Hey guys, it is me again, as you can tell. What's today? Uh, Friday, July 29th, looks like. Yep. Makes it day 210 on our project serving more. Guys, as always, it's, it's uh, good to be here tonight. I'm going to try to make this short and sweet if I can, because I've got to try to get in a bed. And you can see I'm dirty. I've not got cleaned up yet. So, uh, yeah, i got to try to do that. So, But like I said, it, it's good to be here tonight, guys. Hope you all doing all right. Uh, I tell you, it, it's, I got thinking today, it's funny how I just don't know why people can't, you know, whether it's people or business, I don't know why people can't tell you. Why well, they can't do what they tell you. Uh, I don't know. I, I ordered some stuff for the garage. I had to order some stuff last week. And it uh, was supposed to left. Well, I actually got an email saying that it had left San Francisco, California last Friday. So I was expecting it today. It's just some shop stuff that we need. And I uh, expecting it by today. It didn't come. So I got to checking. Number one, they used FedEx instead of UPS. And I don't know why anybody ever still uses FedEx. Uh, I mean, UPS has got them beat so bad. It's just, it's crazy. FedEx may be a little cheaper. I don't know. But uh, I got an email last Friday saying that it was being sent out. And then when I actually tracked it today, when I found out it was FedEx and tracked it, they made the uh, label Friday and sent me the email saying that it was shipped. It didn't leave San Francisco till Tuesday. And from Tuesday till today, so that made me mad. And then from Tuesday till today, which is three days, it's made it from San Francisco, California to Reno, Nevada. And that shows you how bad FedEx is. In three days, UPS could have had something across the country. It's taken them three days to get it from San Francisco to Reno, Nevada. Wow. Anyway, I just had me hurt. Uh, guys, thank you for praying for me. Um, we were actually busy today. Um, didn't get paid for anything, of course. Uh, it's the best day we had all week still, but, but still it was a horrible day. I mean, I think we brought him out 350 bucks. Uh, just horrible. Uh, didn't get paid for anything, of course. I've got more people owe me right now. I've got two friends that owe me a fortune. One for some guns. Uh, and yeah, guys, I've got that bad that I, you know, I, I'm doing something I told you guys I'd never do. I'm selling guns. That's how bad a shape we're in. Uh, I sold two guns the other day. Um... And he paid me half and owes me half. Got another guy that owes me a bunch on a four-wheeler. And then one of my buddies owes me for some tires. And like I said, all these cars today. Well, I mean, we probably got, I don't know how many cars we got fixed today. But I think I got paid for one of them. Uh, you know, all first of the month people kind of deal. And, you know, pay you when I can. And So I don't know, guys. I, I thank you for your prayers. Uh, I mean, today did help. Uh, but it was too little too late kind of deal. Uh, so I didn't get the draw payday. Uh, I'm supposed to have some stuff being picked up tomorrow. Dad said, you know, if you know if, if some stuff gets picked up, he might be able to give me a little money tomorrow. So, you know, we just have to wait and see. Uh, I ain't holding my breath, but uh, I do appreciate you guys' prayers because I mean I can see things starting to turn around. At least today was was you know I had a little bit of a glimmer of hope today. Like I said, even though it was. To be honest, too little, too late. Uh, still, it's better than we have had the last week or so. So, I want to thank you guys for that. Uh, let's see what else. I guess that's about it, guys. Uh, normal stuff. Just, just pray for me. Uh, you know what I've been going through. Uh, like I said, you know me to be selling guns, and I have. Like I said, I sold two. I sold two guns. Uh, I sold my Caltech Thirty Two. My P32 and my uh, Micro Desert Eagle 380. You know, which they were two guns. You know, I've got two Sig Sauer 380s. 
Uh, I didn't need another 380. You know, that Desert Eagle is a little, it, it's kind of hard on you to shoot, too. And, you know, I like actually getting out and shooting my guns. And to actually shoot it quite a bit, it was a little bit rough on you. So, you know, in the 32, they're neat little guns. But, you know, now that I, I've got these SIGs, you know, just basically they were obsolete guns to me. So, figured I'd clear up a little little spending cash. So, uh, guys, let's just pray. Pray for each other. Pray for this country. You know, we need it right now. I'm not going to go over everything like I have been, but we, we need we need to get, we need to hit our knees right now and pray. We really do. So, anyway, let's get on with it tonight, guys. John chapter 7, because like I said, I've got to get in the shower. John chapter 7, starting in verse 11. Here we go. Then the Jews sought him at the feast and said, Where is he? And there was much murmuring among the people concerning him, for some said, He is a good man. Others said, Nay, but he deceiveth the people. Howbeit no man spake openly of him for fear of the Jews. How about the midst of the feast Jesus went up into the temple and taught? And the Jews marveled, saying, How, how knoweth this man letters, having never learned? Jesus answering them and said, My doctrine is not mine, but his that sent me. If any man will do his will, he shall know of the doctrine, whether it be of God or whether I speak of myself. He that speaketh of himself seeketh his own glory, but he that seeketh his glory that sent him, the same is true, and no unrighteousness is in him. This is good stuff from Jesus right here. Did not Moses give you the law? And yet none of you keepeth the law. Why go ye about to kill me? Jesus knew what they were after here. The people answered and said, Thou hast the devil, who goeth, goeth about to kill thee. Jesus answered and said unto them, I have done one work, work and ye all marvel. Guys, that's what I'm going to stop. That's ten verses. Uh, like I said, as always, guys, thank you for being here. I really do. Uh, I don't know if some of my, like I said, some of my videos may start popping up with ads on them. I'm not sure. Uh, I guess I need to go check that out in a minute. But uh, pray for me about that too. Uh, anyway, guys, I love you all, as always. Uh, thanks for being here. I thank you guys for being so faithful. Uh, keep on praying for me, like I said. I, uh, you know, it's just... It, you know, it, it's it's strenuous times right now for everybody, I think. So, especially somebody in my position. So, like I said, keep praying, guys. I love you all. If you need anything, let me know. Good Lord willing, I'll be back here tomorrow night. Until I see you guys again. Good night. God bless.